Welcome back. Nothing makes our man Mike Randall happier than the sight of a new hot dog stand. So you can imagine how happy he was when he discovered one just a couple blocks from our station. This is free range lighter for me. Howard Goldman just fired up a new business. I get covered with ashes doing this. Welcome to Buffalo Hot Dog on Delaware Avenue downtown. I was planning on starting this in the spring. In business, timing is everything. Health inspector came out last week. I was actually LOLing out loud to myself, getting ready because it was snowing out. You may recall Howard's last business on this spot we visited here two years ago. You could get regular donuts anywhere, but, but people seem to really like these model 1901Ls. The Buffalo Department of Coffee and Donuts booth is gone. We were having trouble managing social distancing in that little building. The donut business, with all its merch, lives on. Well, the, well, like all bureaucracies, the City of Buffalo Department of Coffee and Donuts is ever expanding its horizons. This new enterprise was in the planning stages for years. And I, I started with a blank sheet of paper, and um, which is why it took so long. Not just an entrepreneur, Howard considers himself an inventor as well. I'd like to show off my sink that I designed and built. The health department requires this type of business to have running water. You need a sink and it has to work, right? So he created this one of a kind regulation sink on wheels. I could go on all day. I've got an eight hour presentation I give on how I built the sink. Buffalo hot dog is just the next step toward Howard's big dream. Ultimately, I want to uh, open a piano bar in this building and so all the, the millions of dollars I make on this are going to go into that. Are the hours for Buffalo Hot Dog? Well, we're not exactly sure about that yet. I, it's wonderful. I love it. I can tell this is going to be the best hot dog I've ever had. Buffalo Hot Dog, where you can eat like nobody's watching. If I'm here, you know that the weather's halfway decent or I'm really, really broke. Mike Randall, 7 Eyewitness News.